Mel Schneider, and I'm a cinematographer. So as a DP, I've used the CP2s on a number of projects over the last five or six years. And as someone who's always interested in pushing camera and lens technology, it was super exciting to me to see how much they're doing with metadata and how much they're future-proofing their lenses in order to work with the same style of innovation that the camera manufacturers are using because it gives you a lot of freedom to know that these lenses that you're going to invest in now are going to be usable in the future even as the camera companies are coming up with new ways to innovate and use their own metadata and that can be translated to the gear that you already have. So I shoot a lot of uh, different type of projects and I'm often shooting with vintage lenses. So I am a frequent user of Zeiss lenses, although they tend to be vintage lenses from the 60s and 70s. And it's always interesting to see how lens technology has changed from these little Zeiss lenses that came out 50 years ago to the CP2s, which had become a staple with independent film production. Well, if you want to see my work online, you can either go to my website, which is lschneider.com, or you can follow me on Twitter at lschneider, and you can see all the things that I ramble about.